Ladies and gentlemen, welcome again to the analysis of Yoleno TV. Storm had raided Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance over the parliamentary select committees. It is alleged that the just released list of parliamentary committee leaders is now an open secret. Following the confirmation of reports that a setup's meeting organized by President William Ruto and its deputy Rigathi Gachagua turned out to be a compliant area. Mind you, the formation of Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance has a lot of parties that are within. Recently, you notice that most of those people were selected under the cabinet, who were given the cabinet slots. The majority of them came from the Mount Kenya. The majority of them came from the UDA. And those minority parties have been crying foul over this. So they've been banking on the fact that the parliament uh, committees, they would, would, the, 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 the slots of the parliament co committees would be left to them. So when the secret, the list was open, it was evident that again, the Mount Kenya had taken almost all of the seats and that the bigger parties, the parties like UDA, had taken all of the seats and that the minority parties again suffered a major blow. So it is for that reason that there was this brawl, in, you know, there was this heated debate. The argument was so heated in State House and that members threatened to walk out of that uh, the formation. So according to reports, you know, in the People's Daily, you know, when I, I stumble upon it, and it said that some MPs from other parties as well as other regions in the nation accused their counterparts from Mount Kenya of grabbing all relevant seats and, and leaving other regions struggling with less powerful positions. I said that, you know, in the People's Daily, it is well elaborated that the Mount Kenya people could have taken majority of the bigger seats. And it's like the case of, you know, Kukula Nyamayote, Kukula Mbuzi, Kukula Ngombe, Alafu Kuachia, Wenzao Mifupa. So the smaller parties, Omeachua Mifupa. You know, you eat, if the whole cow has been availed, the whole cow is not the government, and then the bigger parties among Kenya decide to, to, to feast, feast on all the flesh, and then throw the bones to the smaller parties. That is the case, that is what we are, that, that is what is being experienced in the Kenya Kwanzaa uh, Alliance right now, ladies and gentlemen. So the smaller parties, are crying that you know the less powerful positions are the ones which have been left to them and that the bigger uh, the, the, the the most of those important and the relevant seats have been you know they are the, the bigger parties and the mount kenya uh, region have taken all of them so the notion according to insiders forced gachagua and ruto to intervene telling the kenya kwanza government uh, mps that parliamentary leadership position will be renewable and those will be who will be found underperforming will be fired and replaced immediately. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a clear indication that there is a lot of problem within the Kenya Kwanzaa government. And I said this, I think there was, I was doing some analysis around there in July. And then I said that this formation of Kenya Kwanzaa government will cause, will have a lot of problems. And I think these squabbles are beginning to be noticed. Now you've seen the members within the Kenya Kwanzaa government complaining that, you know, because those seats which are less powerful are the ones which have been given to minority. And the majority have taken all the bigger positions, positions which are according to what Swahili people will say, pale kuna asali, pale kuna maziwa. Those seats have been taken by Mount Kenya and, and UDA party. Before you go further on this uh, 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 feud, please, if you're a first time viewer and or if you're a regular viewer also subscribe to our channel, please take a moment and subscribe to Yoleno TV. And once again, I'd like to say thank you so much for those who've been supporting us at the, to this level. No, we were analyzing this uh, uh, perceived uh, war of words that ensued in status yesterday. So we've understood that from the from the from the write-up, we have realized that from uh, 
what I've just communicated, it is evident that the smaller parties are not happy. Mount Kenya, it's true that in the Kenya Kwanza government, Mount Kenya played a critical role. All of those allegations of voter bribery, theft of votes, were seen. Most of the, the, the places that uh, they, were, they were a witness were in Mount Kenya. So Mount Kenya played a critical role. So Mosa Skuria previously during the campaign said that how do I Uhuru Mugia Kenyatta Kura? And then in the, when during the the the, 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 the Matakome led team when the submissions were being done, it was evident that in Kiambu County there was a lot of voter bribery, uh, voter suppression, voter inflation, and the like. So it is evident that Mount Kenya played a critical role in the ensuring that Ruto becomes the president of the Republic of Kenya. Perhaps that's the reason why, you know, Ruto and the, 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 the Gaichagua are feeling that they should award Mount Kenya a lot of positions. That is why you find that even in the cabinet allocations, Mount Kenya have taken very many seats. And I think the many, the, 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 that they've taken many seats than even Rift Valley. That could have been one of those uh, arrangements or that one of those decisions that were made during the days of campaign that we will take maybe 50 plus percent and above of the, uh, the, 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 the government. But then since the president is coming from Rift Valley, you will take the other percentage. So um, William Samaruto is as a role to distribute the other positions among the Luya nations among the Costarians, amongst the people of other tribes like the Kamba Nation, and the police also allocate some of his, some of the seats to, you know, his diehards within the Rift Valley. There are people who played a critical role, the likes of Davis Churchill. They played a critical role in making sure that William Samuel becomes the president of the Republic of Kenya. So, those parliamentary committees are very very important to the runnings, running of the parliament and running of uh, the government agencies. Mind you, whenever there's any crisis, then these committees will always call the uh, cabinet uh, CSS to answer to some of those allegations. So that means the cabinet committees, the parliamentary committees keep the government on check. So, you know, they have to be given to... to uh, they had to be given to Mount Kenya because of what I've just described, that Mount Kenya played a critical role in ensuring that uh, William Samuel becomes the president of the Republic of Kenya. So, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to rest my case, but please, if you're a first-time viewer or if you're a regular viewer who's not subscribed, please take a moment and subscribe to Yoleno TV. And once again, until you meet again, with another analysis, please take care and stay blessed.